Hello everyone, welcome back to another video of Iron Man 3, the official game. If you've been wondering about the uh, that tournament armor that was just released quite recently in November, well here it is. Let's go back out of here, you have to win this thing, which is the Mark 31. I mean, you... No, you don't win the Mark 30. Yeah, you don't win the Mark 31 in a battle or anything. You win the tournament by being in the top 10,000 players or so somewhere around there, and then you can just buy it. All right, so it's pretty simple stuff. Uh, description is gone, so you can't really understand more about the armor. I really wish they brought it back, but you know, it had 9.5 score X, um, whatever. Uh, I guess it has 9x, 9.5x score from the original score, special has 5, weapon damage 250, hit points around 5,000, alright, so not exactly 5,000, but, you know. Okay, going in, as you can see, this is a teal green silver-like armor, and it has um, pretty silvery and green-like coloring, very... I don't know, there's not much difference. I, I'd say from this view, it looks like the Mark 7, except different color. But anywho, you can look at the arms, the legs, or whatever you want to look at here, and we're just going to zoom back in, so you can look at the front, up front, I mean up close and personal. Hello there, sir. Alright. Alright, beautiful armor. If you haven't gotten the armor, you should definitely go back into the game and start playing this. What we're going to do is log out and let's go out for a test drive for this armor. Alright. I just noticed there's something about Thor. You you get the Mark 15 Tiger armor. I, I haven't... I haven't gotten the armor yet, but I just saw a special mission, that's what you're supposed to do. We'll take a look at that in the next video. So you should definitely look for the Mark 15 Tiger armor when you see it. Anyway, so we're starting, we're in the forest here, great stage. Um, we haven't looked at this stage, this is a new stage with the new update too, and darn, we got hit. And I, that's because I'm trying to keep balance between... Whoa, that was close. I was trying to, the, there's a bunch of wires connected to the device right now so trying to balance it out at the same time as play as effectively as I can and though the wires is just basically to film this stuff for everyone to take a look at it and give my little commentary and information about how to get this armor and if this is armor is actually cool or not now looking at the armor right now looks pretty similar to whoa uh, to his general stuff, and the thing is, it looks very similar to Igor. Not not physically or visually, but because it has Proton C Shield as his special attack or special skill. And on top of that, he has similar health, similar um, bonus plus, and things like that. So I just kind of threw him into that category because of that similarity. Alright, one of the big difference in the new update is you get to select left or right and usually it doesn't make that much of a difference in my opinion but you know if you just like selecting stuff and having a choice and that's pretty cool there. And we're going to use his super now because he has full bar and we're just going to take a look at how it does or what it does. So similar to Igor, as you can see, it does that Proton Shield Charge. I think it has around 3 or 4 hits, or 2 to 3 hits before the Proton Shield gets annihilated. And one of the big differences in the new update is as you play along in the game, your score X actually increases. So that's really unique. Now, wow, I haven't seen this cave yet. So this is the first time I'm playing the Woodlands. 
it looks really cool um, very beautiful atmosphere and sunshine and things like that all right so we're gonna get this this is pretty I like exploding stuff like that all right all right so we still have full po proton shield as you can see on the top left or right corner and I don't know this suit is very similar to Igor in my opinion because of that proton shield it doesn't have the unibeam blast or the freeze Alright, we're just gonna pop on the Proton Shield right now. Awesome skill to have, and there's this new Credit Overload, where you get to kind of get this new thing that's pretty cool actually, it gives you a bunch of credits. Alright, as you can see the top left corner, there is that score X. It started at 9.5, now it's at 11.9. So, that is something new, that's something new we're seeing without the Alpha Duplicator, which doubles it. This is actually permanent, I mean, as you play on, it, it just increases. So that is something that's really cool, that's added. But other than that, this armor is... You know, it, it's basically the same as Igor. It plays very similar to Igor. It has the proton shield. It has a really strong health and strength and things like that. So there, there's not much of a difference, in my opinion, between this armor or this suit and Igor. Alright, so there's a proton shield kind of thing. Let's just smash into these things and hopefully we can knock them out. Stark Industry. And we're in the farmlands right now. Alright, so as you can see, the score just went up to 12.3. I was saying that it was like 11.9. And this isn't like a one day kind of thing. Oh, the fusion charge. Uh, I just love this. All right, you know that we just flew, we flew long enough. I, I think that's pretty long enough considering I'm not, I, I'm just kind of tilting t bit by bit because there's a bunch of strings attached. But I'm gonna give my little review of the armor. I think the armor, if, if you can win it, it does cost around 650,000 credits to buy. So it's not easy to buy even if you win it. Now, if you don't have Igor, then you probably want to get this armor. And other than that, I'm just going to say that stages are beautiful. I love the new design on the stages. Um, of course, you know, the, the armor itself requires a lot of upgrade. It takes around 20,000 credits per upgrade. So if, if you're just wondering um, what information or what, what you want to know about the armor, the armor does cost a bit even after you win the tournament. So it, it might still take you a while if you don't have enough saved up. But that is pretty much it. So that is this armor in Iron Man 3, the official game.